Trailers either spoil or mislead the viewers so much nowadays, I'd rather just jump into the first episode instead. I'm glad that I didn't even watch the Land of the Lustrious trailer prior to making this video. This particular preview uses many scenes from the first episode, which isn't bad at all, but they are spliced together in an interesting way. Instead of the slow start of the pilot episode, which has a massive spotlight on Foss, the trailer places the Lunarian threat front and center, using the bells to sound the alarm of an attack, framing the illustrious society unaware of the threat as casualties have already happened. These first 20 seconds conveys the message that Jade's warning here is actually for the Lunarians, who in turn cause Foss to shatter. But for anyone who has actually seen the initial episode, all of this is far from the truth. The only reason that the Lustrious Society even knew about a Lunarian attack is because of Foss, and the shattering was actually caused by Sensei himself, as the arrows were never even pointed at Foss until sunset at the end of the episode in an entirely different scene. From the title card onwards, a certain OST is played to carry the danger that is established in the first part of the PV, Trials of Winter, uh, which is only used in one particular episode itself. Visually, the rest of the trailer is spot on with how dominating yet isolated Cinnabar is while showing off the beautiful CGI, so no complaints whatsoever. The trailer is its own thing, and even though it painted the events in an entirely different light, it mostly doesn't spoil any of the experience of getting to watch the series yourself. This makes the total length of this video uh, 1 minute and 55 seconds, which is the exact length of the original trailer. The Natural Historian series airs in 2024, so be ready to rewatch the anime together with me. Uh, I'll see you then. Peace.